Hello. What's up? How you doing? Hello, my name is Abhyudha Srivastava and this video is a part of the My Role Model activity by Gillette India in association with Blogadda. And the elephant in this room is that why am I wearing these shades? It's because the role model that I've selected for this particular video, his name is so huge that I just, I just fear some damage to my eyes when I say his name. I might be bedazzled or you know there might be a huge explosion of aura when I say his name. And his name is Thomas Alva Edison. As you can see, this uh, shock was absorbed by my shades, and that's why they're gone. Anyway, and I mean, look at his career. He has more than a thousand patents in US, UK, Germany, and France. He is the one who gave us the light bulb, the motion picture camera, the phonograph. I mean, I'm sitting in artificial light, talking to you through a motion picture camera and getting my sound, my voice recorded. So, I mean, we are practically talking because of his inventions. These are a more developed form of his inventions, but he was the one who actually thought for the first time about it and brought it into mass scale production. As a kid, he had hearing problems. He sold newspapers and candies in a train. Imagine that. Imagine growing up in such a background and then having the dreams to found companies, make new inventions and that too without a proper education, a proper in terms of the societal norms of an education. He had education only up to the third standard. What do I learn from Edison? The first thing that I learned is that you cannot ever stop dreaming. And not only that, he was the one who brought all this into mass production. He was the first one who made one industrial level uh, research laboratory. So you can understand that he was not just an inventor. You cannot undermine the way he managed his business. He was a entrepreneur par excellence. We talk about Steve Jobs. We talk about people like Dhirubhai Ambani. We do not know that this General Electric, this company was established by Edison and it's still one of the most popular com companies all across the world. So he was a businessman too. And his life has been an epitome of resilience and of fighting against failure. For these thousand above patents, I don't think he got all, all of them right at once. There was always this ongoing struggle. His life is also a message to keep moving. I don't think there was uh, any time in his life there was a point where he had uh, come, become stationary. He always had this momentum to go on, work hard, take a failure take it in your stride and just keep doing what you want to do and in the end it's all about leaving a mark in this humongous universe leaving a small print of yours before leaving the world and if we think about it Edison made quite a lot of difference in all our lives and then there's this famous sense of humor where in uh, one of those magazine interviews, I think it was B.C. Forbes of the American magazine, uh, he told him that he's working on a device that can talk to the spirits or the dead. And it later turned out to be a prank and it was a prank well played, I guess. 
So he was a funny guy too. And now let's have a look at some of the boo boos that I made while making this video. And now some bloopers because while I was shooting this video, I made a lot of, uh, you know, a lot, a lot of uh, mistakes. And now let's have a look at some bloopers because while I was shooting at this, shooting this video, he gave us the light bulb, the motion picture camera, and the the light bulb. <laughs> There are stories how he burnt down a train bogey just because of his exp experiments. There was one experiment going on and some chemical exploded and he was thrown out. His life had been bittersweet. He used to sell candy which was uh, sweet. It was Thomas Alva Edison. Thomas, uh, Thomas Alva Edison. This video was a part of the My Role Model activity by Gillette India in association with Blogger.